Designing a commercial space is very different to designing a residential space. And one of the key differences is that the users change dramatically and they will change through the lifetime of the building. I'm William Smart, the Creative Director of Smart Design Studio, and we are the architects for this building in Alexandria. Alexandria is located about halfway between the city and the airport, and it's an emerging industrial area, which is also a conservation area, so the buildings that are here must be retained. Our vision for this building was to be a good neighbour, and in doing that, we wanted to embrace that industrial character that exists here. Hi, I'm Sarah and this is Nick and we're co-founders of Design By Them. Design By Them is an Australian furniture company based in Sydney and we represent Australian designers in our collection. When we decided to separate our warehouse and showroom, it was a big decision for us. We've always worked together and had the single site in the city. We wanted this new showroom to really feel like our new home and so we were looking for places that really felt sincere, honest in design and beautiful at the same time. And it was really important for us to feel really proud of the space that we were going to move into. It has been 15 years since we've been around and we wanted a nice space. When we were designing this space, we had secretly hoped that it would be a furniture company moving in. And we therefore designed it to have a mezzanine where people could work a showroom at the back with beautiful light and a foyer and entry area for display and receiving clients. And when Design by Them came along, we just thought this is exactly the kind of people we would love to be here. We love the idea of Australian design. We love the product that they show. It feels as though it's a natural fit to the, to the aesthetics as well. The floor plan of this space when walking in from the street will be that you'd walk straight into an entrance area and in front of you is a beautiful staircase leading you to a mezzanine that overlooks this rear space, which is double height and an old industrial space with portal frame structures. I think what's very special about it is we don't rely on the windows uh, to the east or west to illuminate the space, but we have a beautiful clerestory window that runs down the southern side. So you get this wash of soft milky light coming into the space. It renders the quality of light here very light with very soft shadows. as a kind of beautiful space to work in and also to display product in. We instantly fell in love with the space when we first saw it. The studio looks down onto the showroom, so we always feel really connected with the products. It just makes it a much more inspiring space, less typical in terms of an office, and just really nice and open we respect and admire William, and I think the brand alignment is perfect. The attention to detail, everything he does is really well considered, and we really respect that and want to support it by being part of his space. What we've used in the space is very inexpensive, ordinary materials, but there's a very high level of detail to it. We treated every material like a precious resource, so it was put together beautifully, with a great craftsman in a way that looked effortless but required tons of collaboration. So on the walls, it's bagged brickwork. Some of that's new, some of that's existing. On the floor, it's a vitrified tile which was made for commercial kitchens, so it has a cove detail. At the entrance, we have a, a staircase which uses wire as its balustrade but has great detail in how it does that. And in the bathrooms, we use terrazzo. We then work to the outside and develop the form of a building which will be a great addition to the context of the area and also has an embrace of the natural environment and the sustainability opportunities that that site affords. We're both really excited by Australian design. When people, especially overseas, think of Australian design, it's seen in a really positive light and it's been incredible to see it progress over the last 15 years. We work collaboratively with a lot of Australian designers and architects our products are quite playful, so we want people to kind of walk through and interact with them and discover them. And so it's important to give that sense of a journey through a space. We ended up coming up with these floating walls to kind of create that intrigue and a better flow as our customer comes into the showroom. We love playing with colour, but it's always really challenging balancing that out 
in such a neutral space. And especially when you have so many products around, you've really got to be quite conscious of what colours you put together. So once the showroom starts to fill up with lots of different products, it actually becomes quite harmonious. The thing that I'm most proud of is the people that have helped create the space and the team that we have sitting upstairs and the home that we've created for our staff.